do a little bit of this. Send it back a little ahead. That was delightful. <laughs> oh my God, we're gonna go out dancing together when the pandemic's over. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I'm Julie Kogura, Associate Post-Production Manager, and I watch TV for a living. I live in San Jose, California, in Japantown. My brother lives next door, and my sister lives across the street. A Yonsei is a fourth generation Japanese American. My Jichon, he actually made this drawer in the internment camps. What my parents and what my ancestors have done is pass down everything. To me, that's really important to keep the tradition alive. IQC, which is quality control, which is also basically a fancy word for check. Color, music, and sound. I make sure that nothing is wrong. It's really paying attention to detail. I actually did communication studies. The thing that I loved about communication studies is um, my learning disability is on the autism spectrum. And I always wondered how people communicated. I find it very fascinating. And so within communication studies, I got to learn how people communicate. And then I also did a lot of entertainment internships, which allowed me to get the job I have now. I've always been interested in the entertainment business. How do they make things? How does that whole process work? I just didn't know what department I wanted to be in. I'm not much of a pre-production person because um, I'm not into the words and then translating them into images. Production, I never really cared to be on set. Okay, well, I don't like pre-production. I don't like production. Let's see about post-production post-production, I fell in love with. I gained that through all of the internships that I've had. I think I'm good at my job because I know my strengths. And what this job does is it pulls to my strength. So within having my learning disability is we love routines. And so once I establish that routine, if one thing is off, I will mention it and say, hey, we didn't do this thing or we need to do this just to get it on everyone's radar. You can do it if you put your mind to it. Educationally, I had a lot of teachers that told me like, you cannot make it, but my parents always had my back. They encouraged me. And so what I've learned is that I just learned differently. 10 years ago, I was crying that I didn't know if I would make it through high school. And now I wake up today and watch animated TV shows for a living. It's just amazing. And so I would just tell my younger self that you can do it if you believe in yourself. Get in the door. <laughs>